I saw the job advertisement for all these assistant professors in the different area of advances and I forwarded it to colleagues of mine. I thought this is a, is a very interesting chance, but I at that point didn't thought that I would qualify for, for this position in, in my stage. Uh, only when I was really encouraged to apply, I thought I, I give it a try and see what happens and now I'm here. So it's not a bad idea to just try it. <laughs> I'm working with X-ray scattering, so you basically look at how the X-rays are interacting with the material and how they are scattered. And with that you can get calculate back basically how the nanostructure is looking. Uh, Chalmers has quite a lot of these like shared facilities, quite a lot of uh, expensive equipment. Uh, so I can really, as a as a young um, principal investigator, I can basically do science which requires quite expensive equipment without having all the money to, to buy them only for my group. So that is extremely helpful in uh, doing science here. Sweden is a nice environment, uh, especially also for, for young researchers and so on. There is so much possibilities. Uh, the, the whole system is a bit less hierarchical and being back at the university from working at the research institutes um, some years before is also really nice to be again closer to the students, have a lot of contact with PhD students, postdocs and so on. So it's maybe a bit more uh, lively <laughs> around the, the university campus. Uh, I really like the harbour atmosphere, which of course is something very different from what I'm used to from Switzerland. There are no mountains around here, but at least there is the seaside, so that's a good compensation.